Wow, look at this video right here. The wall collapsing at the Walmart facility in Plainfield. Employees telling us they were rushed to safety as fire breaks out at the Walmart distribution center near Avon. One viewer sending us this clip of that moment, the exterior wall collapsed. Stunning footage today there in Plainfield. It has been quite a day. As you can see, this is what the sky looked like. People can see this from miles yeah. away. The good news we can tell you right now before we go too much further is that there are no reports of any injuries. We yeah. do have word that one firefighter did receive a minor injury, but again, no serious injuries, and that is a huge blessing in terms of how serious this right. fire is, how intense those flames are, and now we're talking about the impact on our air quality. There is a team of state inspectors that are on the job checking that out right now. Fox 59's Courtney Savelli keeping an eye on that side of things for us. Courtney? Yeah, good evening, you guys. We have been monitoring this throughout the afternoon. Every time we've spoken with you, things look a little bit different here. I'll tell you right now, the smoke continues billowing out of that distribution center behind us. A little bit less dark and thick as it was earlier as crews continue to put water on it. But again, they are working hard to get that under control. We know that IDEM is also on scene now to monitor the air quality as that smoke plume is being drifted in the wind and traveling for a significant distance as we've been hearing from our viewers. We are now hearing from the fire chief who says they don't know where the fire started, but they are investigating. Initially, firefighters didn't think they'd have enough water to fight the fire, but they do believe they will now. We saw a tanker go by with water and they know that they are bringing in additional help with that. Employees here are still being interviewed and will be taken to the reunification center at the Amazon facility on Smith Road. Meanwhile, residents in the area are told to stay inside and avoid touching any debris as IDEM is here to test that air quality like we just mentioned. They don't have a time frame on when they could finish evaluating that. A lot of information coming in this afternoon. Something startling for us though when we arrived is you could hear what sounded like small explosions from the facility. We know others heard that as well so we asked the Plainfield chief what that was about. Here's what he had to say. It's a Walmart distribution center, so the best I can tell you is if you can think of it, it is probably there. A lot of the noise and stuff you hear, yes, they're described as explosion, but it's the semi-truck tires and stuff that are becoming overheated and, and rupturing. Now, Chief Anderson says there was a state-of-the-art smoke detection system that was working inside. He credits that, says that absolutely helped some of those employees, all of those employees, rather make it out safely. No one will be able to get into this facility for some time as crews continue to fight the flames and investigate. As we told you earlier, an approximate 180 to 200 firefighters here on scene, something that they say this operation could take up to 24 hours to get the flames out here. Reporting this afternoon in Plainsfield, Courtney Spinelli, Fox 59. I knew.